Yazoo County officials said the FBI did determine that student didn't have any ties to that terror group, but authorities say he did threaten to kill himself and another student. Detectives say the teen used Facebook and Twitter to threaten other students. Investigators went to the school and found a necklace made of bullets in the student's bag. That's when they searched the teen's home, but didn't find a gun matching that ammunition. Yazoo County school officials say they're unaware of the incident, but one parent told us a different story. That's where I went to the county high school and waited for him to get off the bus. And we, we uh, detained him, brought him to the Yazoo County Sheriff's Department where he was questioned. It hurt my heart to know that he had an idea to bring a gun or bullets. That's pretty, uh, that's pretty hard feel to swallow. Deputies charge the teen with cyber stalking and harassment. He is currently being held at the juvenile detention center.